Have you ever stopped to wonder about the device you are using right now? It is a small marvel of glass, metal, plastic. It connects you to a world of information, entertainment, people. But this sleek, powerful machine did not simply appear out of thin air. Its story is a long and fascinating journey, a tale of human ingenuity stretching back over centuries. Computers today are an essential part of our daily lives, helping us work, learn, create, communicate. They feel so natural that it is easy to forget they were once the stuff of dreams and science fiction. They began not as pocket-sized wizards, but as colossal, clunky machines that filled entire rooms. This essay will take you on a gentle tour through the history of computer engineering. We will not get bogged down in dense technical details or complex equations. Instead, we will follow a simple timeline, pausing at the most important moments. It is a story of remarkable people, groundbreaking inventions, and quiet, steady progress. We will begin with the earliest mechanical calculators and trace the path to the smart system shaping our present and future. Our journey is structured chronologically, like chapters in a book. Each era's key breakthroughs will guide us. We will see how one idea led to the next, each step making the next possible. From giant room-sized brains powered by glowing glass tubes to almost invisible microprocessors that drive our world. The evolution is astonishing. Better, faster, smaller. So let us begin. A 10-minute stroll through 150 years of change. Simple gears gave way to electrical switches which shrank onto tiny chips, connecting the entire globe. Our story begins not with electricity, but with gears, levers, and steam. In the 1800s, the Industrial Revolution reshaped the world, producing a flood of numbers. Shipping logs, financial tables, scientific data. The work was slow and prone to human error. Charles Babbage imagined a mechanical solution. Calculations performed automatically with perfect precision. His difference engine was a massive device intended to produce mathematical tables. Thousands of precisely machined parts, all working like a magnificent clock. Though never completed in his lifetime, the concept was sound. His analytical engine was a true general-purpose computer in theory. Mill for processing, store for memory. Ada Lovelace, a gifted mathematician, saw beyond mere numbers. She realized the machine could manipulate any symbol, if represented logically. Notes, letters, more. Her